Hey everyone, it's Megan Elizabeth from AboveRubyStudio.com and doing some videos with AboveRubies.ctmh.com and that's my phone, sorry. Um, I wanted to do a video for you guys of a card that I'm doing with the new state stamps from Close to My Heart because I'm making one for some of my Wisconsin friends. I'm going to actually make a couple of them um, because I miss my, miss my Wisconsin home um, and I wanted to use some of my close to my heart embossing folders and my ebosser and just kind of create some fun things. I just got a ton of new stuff from the new catalog. I love it so much. Um, I'm excited to create something with this steampunk, steampunk scoundrels. It's number B1503. Um, it's in the seasonal expressions and oh my gosh is this cute. I love the boo and the bat like a ton. We just had a bat in the house recently and I was kind of thinking of making some kind of scrapbook layout with that because I think it's really funny and it's just cool. Like I think it's really cool and it goes great with the Nevermore um, paper kit which I love. like isn't that beautiful? Like it is Halloween but it's not like screaming ghosts and goblins. Like I think it's so pretty and it's like Halloween-y colors without being over the top. I love this. This is what I'm going to use on the one card and it goes with the steampunk you know, the gears and all that awesomeness. And then the reverse side is little spiders. And then this is really pretty too. I love it. I just really like it. And then it, it also, it comes with two um, of each of the patterns. And then it also comes with two of the four colors here. So um, what colors does it come with? Um, I think it's sunset, right? Yeah, sunset, eggplant, slate, and black. Oh no, that might be Whisper. Oh, it's either Whisper or Sleep. Anyway, exciting. And I want to create something with this. So I'm going to pull this out. Set this aside. Um, I want to use my arrows and I have some um, white cardstock. And I'm just kind of going to see here what I want to make as I go. Okay, so what I'm going to do is cut down this here. I'm going to cut it to just under four and a quarter by five and a quarter. And that should be pretty good for the front of my A2 size card. I think I want to use this. Yeah, isn't that cool? And then I have my white that's going to go on top with my stamps. All right, I want to, I actually do want to emboss this, which I haven't done embossing in a while, but I have this arrows folder that I have been dying to use and I haven't because I don't know. I'm going to put it in here. I love the way the folders are designed. Like they're really a great fold with close to my heart. I'm just going to close that in. My ebossers on. I have all my plates almost lined up. I have to put the other one on top because it doesn't give enough pressure if I don't. And I'm just going to feed that through. I'm so excited. Okay. Um, what I want to do with that is take slate, open that up, and I'm just going to brush it right along the top to give a little more definition to my arrows. Just lightly brush. I'm not like smushing it in. Like I'm literally just lightly, barely touching the surface and it makes those arrows just pop out. And then, let's see what colors do I wanna use? I think I'm gonna use Smoothie and Lagoon. Smoothie and Lagoon for Pennsylvania and Wisconsin. And I'm going to put, it's not going to be like geograph <laughs> geographically uh, well placed. I mean, it'll be east and west, but you know, we're not doing a whole map here. I'm just saying. <laughs> so we're going to go from here to here. And you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to grab a big block because it actually should. Whoops. If I do that, 
You can do both stamps at the same time, which might not be the best thing, but we're gonna do it anyway. We're gonna do it anyway. All right, Wisconsin with Lagoon. Pennsylvania with Smoothie. Boone's already smearing off of here. I didn't prep my stamps very well. All right, and now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the opposite end and I'm going to do like a little, I don't know, dash line kind of thing between the two colors. Kind of like a, I don't know. Back and forth kind of thing. And now I'm gonna grab two different stamps from two different <laughs> collections, which I don't usually do, but this is the Just To Say, and it's from uh, the Cricut Collection for artfully sent that's the card centric cartridge and it comes with so many incredible stamp sayings and sentiments and i want to use the tiny one that says miss you and i'm going to do that in lagoon and i'm going to do it down in the right corner here and then this one says sending love your way now this, this stamp set only comes with the Cricut cartridge um, artfully sent. And you can see it has like congratulations, happy Halloween, best wishes, happy Easter, like everything you could possibly ever need to send a card for, it's in here. It is there one way or another. It's really awesome, I love this. It's a, it's a very much a go-to, you can see I use it a lot, you can see the different ones that um, I grab from it <laughs> quite often. Now this one says sending love your way. And this is from one I, it's called Lifting Spirits. I don't know if it's still available, to be honest with you, with the new catalog. I should know this, I don't. I love it very, very much. Um, if it's not available, I'm sorry. But it says sending love your way. And I know there's some other ones that are kind of close, but it's not exactly the same. And I wanna use the little heart and cloud Actually, I'm just gonna use the heart. I'm not gonna use the cloud. And I'm I'm like kind of reversing the colors. You could see, like, did back and forth with that. And then, um, all right, sending love your way. Now I'm just gonna grab my um, adhesive squares from Glue Arts. And one in corners right on top here the arrows stick out give it a little bit of dimension I love the even the deboss isn't the deboss on that cool I love it love it I did just get the teal shimmer trim I love the shimmer trim so much like one of my favorite embellishments is shimmer trim because it's so easy to like work with and use. And that'll cover up where I, my little snafu of ripping my, I wasn't gonna use it, but cause I messed it up a little. We're going to make it not a mistake, an opportunity to embellish. <laughs> We're just gonna put it right underneath. Lift this up a little bit. We're going to start from the side that it's ripped without ripping the rest. And there we have it. Sending love your way. Miss you card all the way from Wisconsin to Pennsylvania. Ready to go to some friends. I love this. Love these stamps and they're so reasonable. You can pick up your home state or places you visited or lived or vacation spots um, and really just have a great time creating a 
big variety of different cards, scrapbook layouts, and more. Um, great for even geography school projects, and it's just adorable. And then they do come with each set, um, state comes with the state abbreviation as well as the full state name. So I love them. I hope you get your hands on them. Uh, you can pick them up at aboverubies.ctmh.com and all of October we are having a mystery hostess. One lucky person will win all the hostess benefits for the entire month of online shopping for the spooktacular event at aboverubies.ctmh.com. Okay, have a great day. Bye!